Tomorrow we're gonna try out this baby. This is called Liquid Sonar. And it's a product from Finland. And um, I haven't fully tried them yet. I've tried them, but I haven't really tried them. I mean, you need to fish many hours with something before it's really tested it. We're also later on gonna talk about this unit. This is the Fishhawk X4. And I use it mainly to control the temperature uh, at a certain depth on the downriggers. It also has this wheel here, which um, indicates the speed through water at the depth, at the current depth where I have the downrigger. And we also have a receiver uh, in the gear, in the rear of the boat uh, that has the same preference set. It collects speeds through the water and surface temperature. Actually, it's very interesting. First time I used this unit, I've been trolling for a couple of years without it. And I had some really, really good fishing spots. And when I used this, when I hooked it on and, and got out there, uh, the first thing I noticed was that the spots that I've caught fish on uh, had a higher temperature in the water down there at like 25 to 35 feet. Very, very interesting. So uh, this baby actually saved me the other day. I was doing so bad and uh, we actually used it to catch fish, but that comes later in the show. display here, a little touch pen. You can program this unit to uh, take your lure on the planer board down to uh, desired depth or desired temperature range. So you can set either temperature or the depth. So I've set mine for 15 meters because at 15 meters we have lots of bait fish going on and there's a lot of hunting down there. And I already have the downriggers sort of in that area. But as we're turning the boat, in a figure of eight, we attack the current from different direction and that pulls the lead and the wires backwards and it's sometimes hard to know that you're actually fishing the actual depth that you really, really want to fish. So therefore, this product comes into place, which gives you the opportunity to set it for a 100% uh, depth and follow that for the whole day. So uh, we're going to try this one. We haven't tried it. It's got uh, sort of one minute in the water, the test we did before we made the shoot. And uh, uh, you actually can have a look when we uh, sort of launch this baby. Okay, it's got the uh, line coming through the unit like this. And um, it's been attached up here. And uh, what's going to happen is when the fish takes, uh, this one, it, it will stay on. You'll fight the fish it will automatically lose its grip in the water and uh, you will be able to fight and net the fish. So uh, sort of like a flasher, it's in, in front of the lure, uh, not too long. We're setting our counter, sort of taking it back really, really slow. So it doesn't uh, tangle with the, um, the downrigger. This downrigger is at 46 feet and um, the baits are 30 to 40 feet behind the lead. So uh, I think we'll take this one out about 150 feet. That should do the trick. This is a good thing about the synchro reels is that you can just pull it back like that. Takes 75% uh, of the current break off. Perfect rod for downrigger. Putting the sound back on, checking so the synchro is doing the right thing. It, it is. 
<coughs> Looking good. See if we catch something. Feet. Really hooked up. I'm getting the bait out of the way. Uh, doesn't look like a very, very big fish, but it's still a fish. You know, we're happy. So, uh, just working this in. Kicking up the door, getting the net, slowing down. Big. Do you want me to take down, uh, adjust the speed, or can you land in that speed? No, I think this will be fine. We'll have to see that later. So, okay, oops. Yeah, watch the downrigger wire. Okay, secure, put the rod in the holder. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Oh, it's made a, made a great release. Oh, it's fun. a good fish, it's a good day. Yeah, it is. Yeah. So uh, we're gonna release her back. This is a baby, about, I don't know, 11. <laughs> big steel crab. Okay, you got a bigger one. Okay, let's go. Let's do this. Very good. Good, 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 good. Okay, now push it again. Nice fish on the surface rod. Just a light weight, about 30 grams. Yeah, get the stuff in. Get the other rods. And the other down rigger. Would it be nice with a double? Yeah, it would have been nice with a double. It was in the surface. It's strange. 30 grams of lead. Uh, 170 feet. Behind the boat, decent fish, came straight up to the surface, did a lot of funny stuff up there. Yeah, you can lower it a bit for me, please. Take it down to 2.2 knots. Okay, maybe that's good. Okay, keep it there. Yeah. You can step out there and sort of feel it. Feel what it feels like to net the Can fish. Please, uh... So now when it's closing in, I am uh, lowering the pressure a bit on the brakes. Put the net out. Okay, nice landing. Very good, Miller. 